Let's shift gears now to business and engineers should integrate uh, climate smart innovation in their work to meet the demands of changing times. Roads and Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen says heavy rains have brought the engineering profession into sharp focus with calls emerging on the need for reinvention, specialization and leveraging on technology. The engineering profession has over the years come under scrutiny over cases of collapsed buildings and the pressure continues to mount as adverse effects of climate change are felt. We will be sitting down uh, with the road agencies here and the other infrastructure uh, institutions to make sure that we do proper assessment of the situation across the country. Adoption of climate-centric innovations has been identified as a solution to emerging challenges. And we will call upon all of you as engineers to provide lasting solutions and long-term solutions insofar as uh, having uh, climate resilient infrastructure across the country. Murkomen pledged to first track the establishment of the School of Engineering for sharpening the skills of engineers. I hope at the end of our convention we will also enhance that foundation so that 20, 30 years from now the youngsters who stood can also have the opportunity to confront the challenges that we will be facing them at that time. In a population of 50 million, we are fortunate. And that is why we give ourselves this big task to mentor and develop engineers. Engineers Board of Kenya is calling for the full implementation of the local content policy to secure work opportunities for local engineers. Secondly, our chief guest is to strengthen compliance to the engineer site of, of 2011 to 100% by developing and enforcing engineering standards in the national and the county government. The owner Clarion called to have the integration of climate smart innovations in this particular field to engineer for the future. I'm Regina Manyara reporting for Prime Edition.